Good morning. How's everybody this morning? I uh, have the same clothes on, absolutely. Um, oh, boy. Had to take my husband to work, have a doctor's appointment. And uh, then I've got to go do some laundry because I don't have any clean clothes. And since I only had these on while I was recording yesterday, I'm wearing them again. <laughs> I'm like, oh man, I wore that yesterday. <laughs> but it's fine. It's fine. Um, so let's have some coffee together, shall we? Um, yeah. I did. This is our local uh, coffee stand, Bigfoot Java. You know, Washington State is huge on the on the uh, <laughs> Bigfoot. My dad has a picture of Bigfoot. My stepdad, he had a picture of Bigfoot. They were out hunting one time up towards Canada, I think. Birch Bay. No, yeah, he lived in Birch Bay. And then him and a bunch of his friends went um, hunting, I guess. I don't know what they were doing out there. But he got a picture of him. He did. I don't think it's fake. But <laughs> that was a lot of years ago. I wonder if Bigfoot's even still alive, you know? Kind of makes you wonder, right? Anyways, I have a doctor's appointment, um, and uh, my house is a disaster. So this is what I get to come home to after my doctor's appointment. I gotta leave in about 20 minutes. But, yeah, about 20 minutes I gotta go. And then, uh, I don't wanna go to the doctor. Because then after the doctor, I gotta go over to the lab and get some blood draw for my A1C. I hope it's better news this time around. Good Lord. I don't know. Can they just keep upping the medicine? I'm already on the max. Uh, um, what's the name of that medicine? Big toes up. Yes. I take 15 milligrams a day of glipizide, which is a diabetic medicine. It's a type 2 diabetes medicine. And then I take I take 1.8 of the Victoza and then which is a pin. And then I take um, 13 milligrams or 13 units at bedtime and this is a, a actual insulin shot this one is not an insulin shot so um, I take this one in the morning and this one at night and so I do two a day and so I'm on three medicines a day of diabetes medicine and I'm hoping my numbers are better, but I do not know if they're going to be better or not. I hope they are. Here, now my towels look pretty. But I am, I do have a disaster on my hands here. Not very many dirty dishes, however. They're just, the whole, my whole kitchen is just spread with a little bit here and a little bit there. A little bit of this and a little bit of that. So <laughs> I'm going to show you in all my glory. I am, I am. Absolutely. Okay, here we go. It's it's a disaster. I'm going to show you this first even. <laughs> it is a complete th disaster. There is the new growth right there. That little thing right there. And it's growing. This is t grew up off. It's like standing up again. Uh, these two, I think, are dead, but those two are connected, so. And then we have um, our pots for Thanksgiving. We're assigning pots to everything. It's a good idea. I, I've done that every year. 
And then, so I stuck that one in the dirt about a week or so ago. It looks like it's starting to grow. This one, I, it's upside down, so I don't think it's starting to grow. But this one I stuck in the dirt a while ago, and these two are still doing good. I didn't mean to touch it. Now that leaf is probably going to die. This is uh, doing absolutely nothing. So I'll leave it in there a couple more weeks, I suppose. And then we have our kitchen. Okay. So this area is cleaned up. So I can use that area, uh, which I don't mind doing because normally I set it on top of something. So then our water, our pots, and then here we go. This is all the stuff that's set up for Thanksgiving, right? And then I'm making all the dry and the wet ingredients are together. And so this is, um, I got to clean these dishes here, but I got a bunch of crap back here, right? So everything's just kind of shoved back. Um, this is, I've gone through this already. So there's that. And then the dirty dishes are in the sink. The clean dishes are in the, well, most of the clean dishes are in the thing. I don't know. This one's oh, mostly dry, but I got two. And I got one, one dirty, so we're good on that. And then um, I've taken my turkey out of the freezer. And then, and then you wonder, how did I ever fit it in here to begin with, right? Right? <laughs> yeah, buddy. Okay, so then we uh, our refrigerator. And our refrigerator is full, so I'm not sure where I'm going to fit 17 dishes in here. But the turkey is not sh Well, maybe, maybe. It is showing signs of defrosting. But no, it's still hard as a rock, and it's Tuesday. So I don't know what to do. I might take it out for an hour or so when I get home. But these baggies that are filled with stuff are all the dishes. And they have to be in the refrigerator because they got butter or, or cream cheese or whatever. There's one here. So we got mashed potatoes. We got stuffing. We got the bread dip. And we got the turkey stuff. So turkey stuff, bread dip, stuffing right here. Mashed potato bag right here. And then we got the rolls, and uh, that's my cream cheese bagel that I haven't eaten yet. And then the basil for the tomato salad. And the tomatoes are back there somewhere. I'll find them when I get home. So, I am discombobulated to say the least. However, I do have one clean room in the house. One, one clean room in the house. Look at this beautiful bathroom. It's, Fit for a queen, right? Isn't that beautiful? I think it's I'm it's growing on me for sure. Um, so when my husband takes a shower, he doesn't bother to 